you guys. TikTok is a place you can find out a lot of great things. You can meet a lot of great people. Um, and I'm not going to deny that. But I am very disturbed myself by something a friend has uh, recently told me that there are some fucked up men out there who are planning April 24th as National Rape Day, or just Rape Day. I don't fucking know. It doesn't matter. Are you fucking kidding me, fam? How badly do you want to end up in goddamn prison for the rest of your life, never be able to get a job, never be able to do shit, because you're a fucking pig-ass motherfucker? How the fuck bad do you want that, bitch? Huh? Do you, do you want that for yourself? If you want that for yourself, you know what? Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck your whole life. Because it's probably a goddamn uh, waste of life anyway. Like, who the fuck do you think you are, huh? You're going to plan a damn day dedicated to raping people? You know what? I hope the bird of paradise flies up your ass and spreads its wings. That's disgusting. It's disgusting. And the only reason I have any, I know anything about it is I don't really do TikTok. You know what I mean? It's because a friend of mine, she'll send me TikTok videos from time to time talking about this kind of shit. Like, who, who are you? Where, where do you go wrong in your life that you end up being someone who thinks that that's okay to do? Where do you end up with that? Because I want you to know right now, there's other men who have gone on to um, TikTok and been like, oh, there's some men out here who are going to mess you up if you even think this is kind of funny. Think about that. You know? I mean, like, I just want to know where people get in their life, where they get to the point where they honestly think that things they know are wrong or not, right? Like, and ladies, obviously, on that day, or I mean, really any day, not just on April 24th, obviously, but like, that's six days from now. Okay, Saturday of next weekend. So cool. So like women can't go out next Saturday and just kind of like feel safe because there's some dick ass bitch motherfuckers out there who think that they're going to like fuck with people. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Okay. Because here's what's up to like you, you do this to these women. That's cool. But like then what happens to you? You're done. You're the rest of your life is done. You're done. Because you'll get caught because there's enough, ev there's evidence that, you, you know, you're going to get caught and your life is over. So you're, you're good with that too, fam? Like you're good with your whole life being over because you wanted to just prove you could do something? Okay. I mean, like, does it make any sense to you? I think people don't understand, too, in certain situations. You're screwing yourself when you are you think you're screwing over pe other people over. You're actually kind of screwing yourself, too, though, fam. Because, like, there's enough going on there where you can get caught and people are going to know it's you, though. I can't even believe this is something that's existing right now in our world. Like, National Rape Day. Fuck you, dude. Really? Like, I don't know what happened in your life that you think that this is okay to do, that you think that this is funny. But you're an idiot. You're an idiot if you think you're going to get away with it, for one. Okay? Because now every, the whole world knows about it now. So, you're all going to be literally, I mean, they'll be looking out for you on that day. For sure, Okay? that's the first problem because you're dumb enough to announce it on the internet. Like, really? What kind of criminal announces what the fuck they're going to do on the internet? Idiots. Idiots, right? And <laughs> if you're anywhere suspicious, even if you're not doing anything on the 24th, now you're going to be suspected. So why? You know? Why? 
I don't get it. I don't get why anyone thinks it's okay to just like, even if it's a joke. And, and you know what? Someone has said that too. Oh, it's probably a joke. Okay. But it's not funny. And you can't just assume it's a joke. Because that's a very serious thing. Rape day? Dude, that's not a funny joke. Like, so even if, even if it's supposed to be a joke, it's not very funny. And the person who came up with this joke needs to, like, work on their comedy. Because you're not fucking funny. So you should know you're not funny. A. It's a very big thing. You're not fucking funny. Nobody thinks you're funny. And, um... You just need to know that for yourself in the future. Like if you ever want to like have a job again in your life kind of a deal. That kind of thing. Um, if you don't want to have a criminal record. You should know that shit's not funny. Yeah, it's kind of like that. Because like it's not. And... I don't even know what else to say because it's just like, it's ridiculous. I, I, I And then to do it on a platform like TikTok, which I believe that's where it started. I don't know because, again, I don't do a whole ton of TikTok. I just know because my friend sent me a video about someone who was like, hey, dude. It was a guy. It was a guy. And he was like, hey, you have to, you know, if you guys, go, you other men go out there and do this, other guys like me are going to come out there and we're going to beat the shit out of you if you do this kind of shit. Like, that's the only reason I knew. But, like, y'all, this is disgusting. This is disgusting that the world has come to people planning a day like this. Like, where are we in this world that we're planning a day to, like, to, to hurt people? What? Why are we doing that in this world today? What is the, what's fucking wrong with you? Dude, like, what the hell's wrong with you? And ladies, dude, I'm telling you right now, when you go out, make sure that you got, like, buddies with you, that you got numbers you can call, that you got all these things, that you, you're you safe, you know what I mean? Because, like, we got to, obviously, we, we got to be more cautious. Shit, I mean, carry pepper spray. If you can carry a weapon, like, if you are, you have your carrying concealed, do it, dude. I don't know. At this point, it's like, do it. Um, I mean, I don't know what else to tell you. Keep your keys between your knuckles. I don't know, man. Like, you know what I mean? I always thought that that was a little crazy. But like, hey, apparently people are sitting out there planning National Rape Day. So maybe not. Carry a knife in your boot. I don't even know at this point. Like, I'm not saying go around and just like assume everybody's out to get you. Because no. Like sometimes somebody will just actually be like, oh, you're really pretty. And that's what they mean. You're really pretty. And that's what sucks too. Like there's some like super normal men who will literally sit next to you and be like, hey, you're really, you're really pretty. Can I buy you a drink? And they're really legitimate. But now of course, because of all this bullshit, women are like, is he going to slip something into my drink? Like, and, and that's not fair. That's not fair to the people who are actually real good people that we got to, that people, women got to fucking sit here and assume this shit now. Like, do better in life. And most men, well, really, all the men I'm friends with are wonderful people. All the men I know are wonderful people. And that's what's sad is that I know there are so many wonderful men out there, but, like, now they're looked at people who don't know them. Like, if they were just to go walk up to someone, that woman doesn't know he's a wonderful person because there's been so many experiences with men that are And, you know, it's just, why does it have to be that way? Because that's not fair. Like, there's so many good people out there, so many good men, and that, and they have to kind of be afraid, too, because they're constantly being looked at as people who are associated with men like this who plan rape day. What? Like, wh what? Do better, guys. Do better. I really hate for this to be a Monday video, but anyway, I um, this is it, and... Um, look out, ladies, please. Um, it's important. I mean, I'm going to hate it for it to be our Monday the 19th video, but it's going to be. And I am going to, I am going to today, Monday, record the 
Child Play 2 uh, reaction video because it's something a little bit more fun. Not really because it's a doll that's possessed by a serial killer, but, you know, it's a little bit more lighthearted than this because it's not real life. So that's cool. Um, and check out my other content. Please subscribe and please be safe. Um, just in general, obviously, right now. Wear a mask. Um, you know, and have a good rest of your night or day. I don't know when this is going to go up. Day, night, whatever. Have a good rest of it, though. Okay? All right.